Daria Kirilova has been delivering crates of organic vegetables through central Vienna on her giant cargo bike. The load gets lighter, of course, after each delivery. But what did it weigh when she set off this morning? Well, uh, it was around 160, I think, 170 kilos. Could have been up to 200 with no problem. These large cargo bikes are redefining what you can achieve in the city via emission-free pedal power. Daria explains why a cargo bike service like this is a viable alternative to the traditional diesel truck deliveries that we have become so used to. Well, you're faster, you can find a parking place and yeah, it's environmentally friendly and I, I just like to ride bikes. <laughs> For me, it's my job. <laughs> I want to ride my bicycle. Jeder Volvo Kombi verblasst, wenn es ums Ladevolumen geht. But don't expect to see cargo bikes being pedaled down the motorways. This is a form of transport ideal for the final leg of the journey from factory or farm to the heavily populated areas of inner cities. The so-called last mile deliveries explains Florian Hofer, who oversees the logistics for the cargo bike fleet of the first heavy pedals. Last mile delivery is a system where you have hubs spread out all over the city where a truck which is coming into the city only has to deliver his stuff at one place and from there on the last mile gets done by alternative transportation like cargo bikes or also vans with uh, uh, electric engines for example. So that means the big trucks only have to go into city once and then go out. A nine-year-old child was crushed to death by a truck earlier this year while walking near his school. The tragedy has refocused minds on the issue of street safety in Austria. One answer is technology to tackle the blind spots of trucks. Another is to reduce the amount of motorized traffic on the roads. But whether it's to encourage cargo bikes or just bikes in general, Florian Hofer says the government has to act. To think over the strategy and step up the game when it comes to cycling infrastructure. Because this is, in my point of view, the key part. A lot of people don't feel safe while riding their bikes in the city and you have to get to these people. I want to ride.